As stated on the warning, this film contains label on the back cover of the movie I'm about to review. It cautions you, so be careful going into this, I guess. It then says it contains intense sci-fi action. Action? Yeah. Sci-fi may be a wee bit, but intensity? That's bullshit. But the one thing that caught me off guard was the fact that they put some adult situations in there as well. As if children couldn't handle literally a Transformers ripoff meets a Cloverfield ripoff. And no. I'm not making any of this shit up. Welcome to the horror show! To realize there is nowhere to run! No, no, came to try! There are noises hiding your life! Welcome to the horror show! To realize there is nowhere to run! No, no, came to try! Attack from beneath. Or as I like to call it, Atlantic Rim. Which is actually its original title. Sounds strikingly similar to that other movie called Something with a Rim. Hmm. Must have been a rim job porno. Oh yeah. Just for clarification, I'm not gay, nor am I a pervert. That is just the way the review flowed. I'm sorry, okay, so back to the review for Attack from Beneath, which is basically a ripoff of Pacific Rim, just done on a much cheaper scale. The characters? Annoying, stupid, and clumsy. I mean, when the characters disobey an order, it's done in such an annoying way. I mean, like in most movies where they disobey an order, it's for the greater good, but this one, it's like... We're doing it because we're schmucks. Like when one of them gets the monster in their shot and they go run after it like, I'm gonna get you. I'm in the way! Now really think about this. What would have happened if he was still in the way and you took your shot? I'm in the way! <laughs> the asylum... <laughs> Moving on. The CGI and special effects. The CGI in this movie is decent for some of the time, but if you want to talk about special effects being in this movie at all, then you gotta talk about the scenes with gore. And there are very, very, very few scenes with gore. Actually, technically speaking, there are no scenes, except for a guy getting stepped on the knee, lifts up his foot, and he's at the mushed up body. And uh, soldiers getting eaten off screen with their hand falling off the side of the railing and their blood drips down on it. It's cheap. The plot. It's Pacific Rim, but with a lower budget. Is there really anything else you need in a movie called Attack from Beneath that's basically like Pacific Rim, which is basically like Godzilla? I don't think so. Too bad it was done shitastically. Overall, I give Attack from Beneath a 1.5 out of 5. Also, if there's any movie that ever signifies that if you wear an eye patch, you're evil, this is the big one. Or the small one. Yeah, I just went there. I am Brian Gatto, host of our show Movie Reviews. Make sure to like my Facebook page in the description below and to leave comments and subscribe.